911, what the address is happening? Um, possible missing child. I have a three-year-old that's been missing for a month. A three-year-old? Yeah. Have you reported that? I'm trying to do that now, ma'am. We can't find my granddaughter. 911, what's your emergency? <laughs> I called a little bit ago, the deputy sheriff saying I found out my granddaughter has been taken. She has been missing for a month. Her, her mother finally admitted that she's been missing. Okay, what is... What is there's something wrong. I found my daughter's car today, and it smells like there's been a dead body in the damn car. Okay, what is the three-year-old? Okay, they want to talk to you. Sorry? Can you tell me a little bit what's going on? My daughter's been missing for the last 31 days. And why, why are you calling now? Why didn't you call 31 days ago? I've been looking for her and have gone through other resources to try to find her. We're talking about a three-year-old little girl. Surprise. Do you understand how I feel? How I feel? He thinks you guys did something to Kaylee. I feel the exact same way. I've done something. I've, I've, I've done something. Surprise. Surprise. Do you understand how I feel? How I feel? He thinks you guys did something to Kaylee. I feel the exact same way. Someone let me... Come on! Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. We're not doing well, kids. None of us. Someone just, someone just said Kaylee was dead. Kaylee was dead. I don't care. I don't care. I want to see that little girl. I want to hear Kaylee laugh. I want to be with my baby. I want her to be found. I want her to be found whether I'm still stuck in here or not. That's exactly how I feel. It's the truth. Mom, I don't have anything. I'm sorry. I've been here a month. What the hell is going on? My entire life has been taken from me. I don't, I don't have any answers because I don't know what's going on. I don't want Kaylee. You guys are not understanding my side on this. I can't even think straight at this moment. What the hell is going on? My entire life has been taken from me. Dad's blown up at the media. Yeah, I heard. Everybody's saying you're lying. Because nobody 
listening to anything that I'm saying. They're twisting stuff. They're, they've already said they're going to pin this on me if they don't find Kaylee. Don't find Kaylee. They said that the person that you dropped Kaylee with doesn't even exist. Doesn't even exist. Because, oh, look, they can't find her in the Florida database. If they would actually listen to anything that I would have said to them, they maybe could have tracked her down. They haven't listened to a thing that I've said. How come everybody's saying that you're not upset, that you're not crying, that you show no caring of where because Kaylee is at all? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I don't want to get into this with you right now. I'm hanging up. I need to make this other call. <laughs> I'm very sorry and never do it again. <laughs> Don't punish me. <laughs> I'm not a bad person. I'm not. <laughs> and to the custody sheriff of Pinellas County. I've done something. I've, I've, I've done something. Surprise, surprise. Do you understand how I feel? I feel. He thinks you guys did something to Kaylee. I feel the exact same way. I've done something. I've, I've, I've done something. Surprise, surprise. Do you understand how I feel? I feel. He thinks you guys did something to Kaylee. I feel the exact same way. Someone let me. Come on! As to the charge of first degree murder, verdict as to count one. We, the jury, find the defendant not guilty, so say we all, not guilty. I left about 10 30, 10 35. Like, he looked at Casey Anthony. I'm like, okay. And I just couldn't keep my eyes off of her. I began to back out and looked, and I could tell she was staring directly at me. I could almost see the white in her eyes. I proceeded to pull out of the parking lot, and she was right behind me. I said, oh my God, help me. She hit me again, causing my vehicle to flip two and a half times, landing on this driver's side. And I just lay there playing dead. I got to her. She was crying. She was shaking. She says, Mama, this lady thinks I'm Casey, you know, Anthony. She tried to kill me. She said that um, I was trying to hurt babies. I was killing babies. And she was going to stop it before it happened again. She could have taken me away from my family, my daughter. Well, I don't look that much like her. So what about people who actually do look like her? and live closer to Florida instead of Oklahoma. What's gonna happen to those people? What's gonna happen to those people?